here in the United States, we are fortunate to have many traditional holidays that are uniquely American. But none of them are quite as special as Thanksgiving. Family and friends from all over the country join together to give thanks and share in a joyful feast and watch TV. One of the favorite parts of that feast is cranberry sauce. Here we see the cranberries at the processing plant right after being picked. And here, just before being shipped to your local store. Uh, excuse me, sir. Is there any special technique in canning cranberries? Oh, you mean cranberries. How else do you think we can cram so many of those little fellers into these itty bitty cans? And the best part is, they work for peanuts. And of course, no Thanksgiving is complete without a turkey. Speaking of turkeys, look at what we have here. Our hidden camera has found one of the few lucky turkeys who have managed to avoid Thanksgiving so far. Let's try to ask him how he's managed it. Excuse me, Mr. Turkey. Martha, you've done it again. Mm -hmm. I don't know when I've tasted a more tender turkey. Oh, it was just some odds and ends I threw together. I don't know if I can eat another bite. <laughs> I'll fix your bromo for you, dear. I think I left it in the kitchen. Uh oh. <laughs> Here's your bromo, Harold. Why, thank you, my dear. Gosh, Mom, that was the best Thanksgiving dinner ever. <laughs> Now, Sissy, you know better than to talk with your mouth full. Harold. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> uh -oh. Gee, I'm stuffed. Say, I've got an idea. Let's all take a walk together and work off this excess baggage. Oh, I don't know, Dad. Gee, Dad, I mean, I don't Star know. Drags Star comes Drags on is coming yeah, on in a couple right, right away. Just go and get your coats. Food! Food! If you kids are good, maybe we can stop by the Dairy King for dessert. Oh, you've got a deal, Dad. A wise guy, huh? Hey, who you calling wise? Oh, you! You roach hotel refugee! Oh, yeah? Yeah! Waiting for us to leave, huh? So you could steal yourself some turkey. I'm warning you, you no good flea factory. If so much as a pea is missing when we get back, you'll be an outside alley cat forever. <laughs> All right then. Just don't forget what I said, or else. Oh dear! I'm telling you guys, every Thanksgiving it's the same thing. There I was, minding me own business, when who should I bump into 
but one of them garbage picking roaches. Oh, wow. And you know what he does to me? Oh, no, what? He conks me on the head and steals me share of the Thanksgiving victuals. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm fed up with this kind of treatment every year. There's only room for one pack of vermin in this dump, and that's us! Yeah. It will be a whole year before we see another Thanksgiving dinner. <gasps> and the only thing between us and starvation are those thieving mice. <laughs> they mean to separate us from the turkey, the potatoes, <laughs> the candied yams. <laughs> Comrade insects, how much longer will we allow our life's blood to be snatched away and devoured by those undersized rats? He didn't say anything about the stuffing. The pink giants have gone out for a walk. Our only chance is now. Are you with me? Yeah. 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 in the living room watching the tube. Thanks, Brownie, me boy. Uh, this is just the opportunity we've been waiting for. Cheesy and Knuckles, you take some of the boys and cover the assault on the turkey. While we're doing that, someone's gonna make sure that the TV set is playing good and loud so's the cat don't hear nothing. Now, all we need is someone stupid, uh, <coughs> brave enough to go out there and take care of the cat. Uh, oh no. Not me! I ain't going out there, no siree! And there's nothing you can do to make me! No! Oh, Marsha. When you look at me, I... Hey, did you hear something? Oh, John. What could it be? It sounded like a melon flung against the door. No. It was more like a tomato thrown against the wall. Definitely a melon sound. John, my sweet dingleberry. I know my fruit, and that was a tomato. Artillery. Goop that guy. I'm 
Take care of the leftovers. Ah! What? What happened? Who could have? You? Why you? I told you what would happen to you. 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 Try living in the cold and finding your own food. Some Americans prefer to provide Thanksgiving dinner in the traditional way of our forefathers. Take this intrepid fellow. Well, it certainly looks like he bagged Thanksgiving dinner. Nice shot, sir. Uh, what did you get? A turkey? A pheasant? A duck? Ech, are you kidding? I'm a vegetarian. People aren't the only ones who enjoy Thanksgiving. Our animal friends celebrate it as well. Here's a mother rabbit in her kitchen. Uh, pardon me, Mrs. Rabbit. Are you making Thanksgiving dinner for your family? Why, yes, I am. And let me tell you, every single year, it gets harder. <laughs> See? <laughs> Well, it looks like our hidden cameras have found more lucky turkeys who have managed to avoid Thanksgiving. Please don't run away. We'd just like to ask you turkeys a question. Turkeys? What turkeys? Uh, we're mooses. Uh, he means mooses. was terrible. Almost everyone lost their jobs, and most families became poor. It was a time without television. Without video games, there were no designer sneakers. Well, don't just stand there. Come on. But somehow, families struggled to keep together, despite tough times. I'm sorry, kids. What with this Great Depression going on, I still haven't found a job. Don't worry, Mom. You will. What's a poor family to do? I was really hoping to have some sort of work by now, so I could make you a real Thanksgiving feast tomorrow. Where's your dinner, Mom? Oh, I'm not very hungry. Mom's ready to give up her own dinner, so Sam and Emily can eat. Isn't there anything to do? There's a whole nother can of beans on the counter. You could have that. Oh, no. That's all we have for dinner tomorrow. Tomorrow? But Thanksgiving's tomorrow. 
Don't worry, Mom. Things will get better. Sure they will. We love you, Mom. I love you, too. Sweet dreams. Poor Sam and Emily, and Mom, too. It doesn't look like they'll be having Thanksgiving dinner tomorrow. But they can always dream about it. Can't they? You bet they can.
got you now, Pipsqueak. <laughs> Thanksgiving. But no matter where they are, Americans usually manage to have a traditional Thanksgiving turkey dinner, even in outer space. Pardon me, sir, just exactly how do you manage to have a traditional Thanksgiving dinner here in the cramped quarters and weightlessness of the shuttle? Simple. Dehydrated food. Just squirt a little water into this pouch, and instantly I have turkey with all the trimmings. That's amazing. Uh, just out of curiosity, how does that stuff taste? Darned if I know. I've never been able to catch it. One of the pleasures of Thanksgiving is seeing our dear, sweet grandparents. Uh, er, excuse me, going upstairs for a post-pig-out nap? Well, no. We're going to watch some TV. Oh, a heartwarming old movie. Oh, heck no! We're going to watch some bone-crunching football. Yeah, hold her arms in. After tracking the elusive turkey for many miles, we now may be close to answering that age-old question. What exactly do turkeys oh. eat for Thanksgiving? Uh. Yes, yes, this is the moment we've been waiting for. We are about to make scientific history. Excuse me, please. Ever since the Pilgrims first started Thanksgiving with its traditional turkey dinner, man has wondered, what do turkeys eat for Thanksgiving? Would you be kind enough to show us? Sure, why not? You were expecting burgers and fries, maybe? 